Welcome, everybody. The Stardew Valley 1.6 update is out officially right now. So the update adds a bunch of new stuff to the old part of the game. Lots of little details that we'll discover as we're playing. So we're going to go ahead and jump in and see what things we can notice. Uh, we're going to be Dan. We are going to have an orange cat named Tifa. We're going to be um, Comfy Farm. Favorite thing is... Hot dudes. Yeah. Let's go ahead and... No, oh, mayo. That's it. Favorite thing is... Drinking mayo. There we go. Drinking mayo. Okay, got our little overalls on. I like the default hair. Okay, the new farm is Meadowlands Farm. Which is not the best for growing props, but there's chewy blue grass that animals love. You start with two chickens. Uh, remix community bundles. Remix mine rewards. I like to lower the profit margin a little bit. Make the game a little tougher because the profits are a little insane. Uh, cabin layout, random seed, legacy randomization. Alright, um... Okay, and then let's start. Uh, restart Steam if you don't have the update yet. Grandpa, no! Grandpa's just resting. XX years later. Dear Dan, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of change. Same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what really matters most in life. Real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Comfy Farm. It's located on Stardew Valley on the southern coast. Perfect place to start your new life. This is my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. Now you honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. Who is still alive? Say hi to the old guy for me, will you?
Thank you for that resub, Darties, and that one guy you know. Hello, you must be Dan. I'm Robin, local carpenter. Mary Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. It's right there now. Time thing up for your arrival. Farms, uh, right over here if y'all follow me. Grandpa kind of let this place go to crap. This is Comfy Farm. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath it. Underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Has he released the uh, full update notes yet somewhere? It's recommended you do it a, a new save if you haven't. And here we are, your new home. Oh, new full update. Okay, thank you guys for linking in chat. Ah, the new farmer. Okay, it's a massive amount of... The 1.6 update is huge. There's so much stuff there. Fixes, quality of life changes, balance changes. Um, multiplayer visual improvements. New items. Many new NPC dialogues. New two new festivals. No, three new festivals. A mastery system accessed by a new area grants powerful perks and items. A new farm type, Meadowlands. Oh man. The the it's a laundry list of of, of things that it's huge. I'll link it in chat for you guys when to read through it yourself. Here is the full patch notes. I'll link it in all three of our chats on YouTube and TikTok. I don't know if the link will work, but there's a link for all you guys. Yeah, it's a big update. I'm Lewis. You know, everyone know, uh, everyone's been asked about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Uh, so you're moving in your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. Uh, he recommends not reading the notes before playing. Okay. I'm going to close them. I'm going to take them out of my brain and throw them away. Forgot everything. Playing blind now without any sort of hint of what's happening. Just threw it out of my brain. Rustic, that's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Rude. Don't listen to her, Dan. She's trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. She's a capitalist, you know, in a small town. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you gotta explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. Townspeople would appreciate that. I almost forgot. You can sub with Prime Gaming over here on the twitch.tv. You just click the sub button and use the drop down. They hit it so you can't find it anymore, but it's still there. I'll come by tomorrow on the night to ch collect after you put stuff in this box to sale. Well, good luck. Thank you for that follow on TikTok, uh, Kimmo Receiver. I guess it's time we start playing Stardew Valley again. Yes, this is the perfect time to play again when there's a big old update. If any guys are not getting a game to update, restart Steam. That'll fix it. This looks different. I don't remember streamers being here before. Are these new? Were these here before? Wait. It, that wasn't there either. This seems more decorated than before. Ooh. Hey times 15. Oh, I, I'm in a bad spot. I'm going to move myself. No. It's fine. I'll leave it there. 
Wait, no, not here. Right here. Hey, 15. Okay. Oh, yeah, different farms give different houses. So I should start with a coop now. Yep, see, there's the, uh, there's the chickens. So I start with chickens now, which is great. And they have the special bluegrass. And, oh, look, waterfall. You put waterfalls all over the place as well throughout the game. The waterfalls look gorgeous. Let's uh, see what's over here. I'm curious how far over this uh, new farm goes. Seems like there's a lot of farming land here. There's still a good chunk of farmland. Mm -hmm. All right, up here. Break that. I'm trying to get like a good t uh, feel for how big the space is here. Seems like there's a good chunk of land here. Okay, so it is surrounded by water, too. So the uh, metal is, is uh, confirmed to have a river in it. Yeah, this is the new farm. Um, let's, let's actually let's see if I can, can I zoom out? There you go, I can zoom out a little and see a little bit more of the farm layout. Okay, so it's pretty good. It's a nice layout. Yeah, it's like... You can take a screenshot of the whole farm. How do you do that? Take a screenshot at the game. Options. Uh, where do you do that? I don't think I've ever done that before. Below the zoom options. Oh, screenshot. Okay, let me figure out where that went. Give me a second to find it. <laughs> Pictures, screenshots. I have no idea where that went. <laughs> I don't see it anywhere. I will have to find that later. It's somewhere. We will find it later. Uh, shift tab will show it. Screenshots. Nope. Oh, well. I'll find it later. Okay, so here's the greenhouse. And then is... Where is the cave? <laughs> Look around. Yeah, greenhouse is right there. I don't see the cave system. I don't see how to get to it, actually. All right. Well, I love that you start with a with your oh, you can't farm on grass, can you? Like this this area. So that's not farm farmable land, I don't think. Yeah. Uh, the update is small because the game is small. It's just pixel art and stuff, and no voice files, no cutscenes. Yeah. So all this space here is not farmable. So we'll have to keep that in mind. It did say that the um, this is not great for uh, crops. I get a little bit of land here though to work with. All right, um, getting started. Harvest an egg from your chickens. Greet all the people in town. Yeah, let's see. Kit. Yeah, I can't can't make a farm here. 
So we'll have to make sure that we put these on places. It's going to be interesting to figure out how all that works. Yeah, we start with chickens. Looks like we have two baby chickens. Hi. Hello. Buster. He's not Buster. He's... Bussin. <laughs> Bussin and... You are... Little nugget. You're a little nugget. <laughs> Chicken nugget. <laughs> All right, beautiful. So they won't be able to make eggs for quite some time. Oh, I, I did I get... Oh, I need to give them hay. Let's go put the hay over there. So normally you get um, parsnip seeds to start, but it looks like on this farm you get hay instead. It's more about um, animals and his crops. Okay, let's get start clearing this out for our beginning stuff. So I don't have any... No seeds at all. Oh, uh, we're... We don't know what the new update is yet. Um, all we can do is play the game until we run into new stuff. They do have full patch notes if you want to spoil yourself, but he recommends playing without spoiling yourself, just to uh, play and discover things as you come across them. Wait, bookseller? These are new. Egg Festival, Flower Dance, what's well, Bookseller? Books? There's also a star thing here as well. Hmm. Oh, Pierre. Hello, Pierre. I will take, um, I'll take the bean starters. These are a good investment because they continuously give me more stuff. Hello, Pierre. I like the green beans because they constantly give me more green beans without having to buy more. Cauliflower will be next. Let me get the crop set up so I don't forget. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, chop. Chop, chop. We'll just do a very, very basic farm for now. And worry about, like, making it pretty later. The most basic of basic farm stuff. Four, one, three, four. If I do it like this, then I could put there we go, and then we will water everything. Oh, basic tools, I remember. Oh. That's cute. Uh, the game's out on Steam. It, every other platform, I, it depends on how long it takes them to upload it up there. So we'll see. I don't know um, if you have it on Game Pass, if you have it on other systems. Just have to wait until you see it. I don't know if he it didn't publish any sort of time frame or anything. Anything new in the menu tabs? Let's see. Wait, what is this down here? Was this always here? Is this new? Yeah, that's that's new. I don't remember that from the start there. 
Oh, um. Crafting, that's still the same. Uh, animals. Nugget, bussin. Specialty items and powers. Collection option. I want to show the tool hit bar, yes. Item stowing. Advanced crafting information, yes. Um, mute animal sounds, no. Zoom button, show transparency. Nope. Okay. Yeah, it seems like there's a few items there that I don't recognize on the menu. So figure out what those are over time. Let's clear this out. Uh, did the map change? Uh, let's see. Do you recognize? Do you see anything that you don't recognize from before? This all looks the same. Yeah, it all, I think it looks the same. I can't tell. Although there are cherry trees on the map now, which I don't think were there before. It's like more. It looks a lot more detailed. Yeah, it, like the, the detail on the map is far better than it used to be. Much more accurate too. That's nice. Animal and Star Tab was new. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm excited to see what else, we, what things we discover. We got to go talk to everyone in town. Let me use my little bit of energy, and then let's go. Let's go chat, people. Yep, the new update is out, 1.6, and we're playing with the new farm, the Meadow Farm. Thank you, Rana, for that follow. I appreciate that on TikTok. All right, let's see. Um, hello, who are you? Stranger, my name's Vincent. Mama said not talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Hello. You're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. If it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be cute. What the... Um... Wow. Judgmental. Hello there. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Quite a little town, so I'm excited when someone moves in. Having a farmer around could really change things. Okay, watch out. Well then. Oh, hi. Hi, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Hi, Sam. I Haley has a really good character development. Like, she starts out real mean, but she gets really nice over time. Let's see Jody just passed. Let's go talk to her. <laughs> Hello, cows. Hey, Jackie, thank you for the Prime Gaming sub. It's locked. Oh, she's in there already. One mod I already missed is the mod that shows you on the map where the NPCs are. I love that mod. One of my favorites. Uh, I want to go to the game, but I, I need to know what um, what to do. I, I want a guide. Oh, there's lots of guides for lots of beginner guides on Steam and other places if you want to look up what to do. But this game, um, you don't really need to. It's not a hard game. It's just like play naturally. It's the most fun. Just discovering things on your own is really nice in this game. There's no need to min max. It's very casual. Hello, Pam. Hey, kid. Name's Pam. Nothing like to sip the good old stuff to warm these old bones. 
Why, hello there. I'm Gus, chef, chef and owner of Star, Star Drop Saloon. Welcome. Can I get you anything? Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in uh, the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Oh, uh, I forgot to have the Twitch set up. Yes. Let me do that real fast. Because it is actually out now. All right. Uh, Emily is a nice uh, bride if you're looking for a nice uh, waifu. Uh, hi, I'm Clint. Clint looks like me. <laughs> I'm a, I'm the town blast. You ever need to upgrade your tools? I'm your guy. I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Shane. Shane is a nice, uh, Shane is a, uh, good husband, if you don't mind someone that has, like, a backstory and a troubled past, you know, has a little bit of depression. Uh, can I go anyone's homes? Nope. Apparently I'm not allowed to. You could probably go talk to Linus up here, although it's getting really dark. I can barely see I forgot how dark it gets in this game. Okay, chop all that down. I can fix him, said many a person. I actually divorced Shane because I, uh, I didn't like him as a husband doing my playthrough. <laughs> he was... Uh, he just wasn't great for me. And then I married Harvey instead. Who was slightly better, but not much. <laughs> Harvey's not bad because Harvey is one of the good that one of the people in the town that has a really good job. He's a doctor. So he's like he's bringing in the, the bacon. Let's go sleep for the night. <laughs> uh, Willie, back from fishing trip, you should drop by the beach sometime. Oh, Willie. Shane left my house messy. Yep, that's why I got rid of him. He's very messy, and his house, his personal room in your house, is very messy. And I was like, nope. Can't do it. Sorry. Where are my chickens? Are you guys? Okay, I think you're in there. Let me clear out their little space here. You know, I actually do not see my chickens. Oh, there they are. <laughs> they appeared randomly. Okay, let's get rid of everything except the bluegrass. Oh, okay. It'll grow back, but let's just chop. So apparently this new grass is something that the animals love. So maybe increases the quality of animal products or something. Okay, that one little bit is going away there. We'll try to keep it nothing but bluegrass in here. Okay, chop that. Uh... Yeah, I don't know what happens uh, when they eat the bluegrass. We'll find out. Let me uh, chop this and that. Open up this. Oh, I forgot to tell them I love them. I love you, and I love you too. 
I was hoping for a swamp farm, maybe someday. Let's hope. What's new, Precious? Lots of stuff is new. Um, you can spoil it if you want, want to by reading the patch notes. Otherwise, um, they recommend not reading the patch notes and just playing again and then discovering new things as you go along. Yes, I love Bussin. He's great. All right, and did I water? I think I did. Yes. Let's get rid of. I think I need that. Ah, I'll hold on to it. I don't know what I need yet. Okay, crafting chest. Definitely need that. Let's get a chest out here just to have somewhere to put stuff for now. Oops. Put all that in there. Cave is down to the right side of your ranch. Really? They moved it down there? Oh, the cave is down here. Wow. That's so different. So we finally found the cave. It's down here now. I'm curious if you made the cave better because the cave is kind of boring. Looks like it's still boring, but okay. Well, it's fine. It's just boring. You just go in there once a couple, a couple of days, and get your little mushrooms. Not much to it, or your fruit from your fruit bats. It's, it was. It's never the most exciting room. There's a mod that turns it into a hot spring. Ooh, that sounds amazing. Meadow farm layout tour, please. Sure, I'll get when we go back there. I'll uh, show you around a little bit. It's it's a nice layout. Okay, who do we have? We not we haven't talked to to, to Harvey. Let's go to Harvey. Hi. Oh wait, no, not not you. I'm not gonna go around and talk to you. Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Chat, type in the chat, who is your number one pick for husband or waifu? You always end up going with them first. I'm Harvey. Ooh, Elliot, Sebastian, Sam, Leah, Elliot, Abigail. I, I love that there's so many different choices people are picking that means that he did a good job making everyone like desirable to somebody i'm harvey the local doctor for regular check out some medical procedures for all residents of the town is rewarding work alex someone likes muscles that's fine you're allowed to like those muscles Oh, speaking of Alex, here we go. So, hey, you're the new guy, huh? Cool. Hey, I heard someone saying that you got your first chicken the other day. Man, I wish Grandma had chickens. I'd eat a dozen raw eggs for breakfast each morning. Ew. Why? Heh, <laughs> it's irritating to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now, buzz off. Hmm. Sorry. George uh, starts out really mean, but he gets nicer over time. Uh, what's that? Yeah, sun deer, I think is the term for it. When they start out cold, but end up nice over time. The mayor's house is somehow much nicer than everyone else's. It's a little unfair. Wait, what's that? Red tickets. 
Pelican Town Ledger Book. It looks like the mayor uses to keep track of finances. Pelican Town Marriage Log. If marriage, you may file for divorce here. Let's hope that isn't necessary. Divorce? Town's lost and found box. So you can officially file for divorce now. Ooh. Interesting. Mayor's Fridge. Was that there before? The divorce little interaction thing there? I don't remember that. It was? I, I don't think I ever divorced someone like that, so maybe that's what it is. I can't remember how I got rid of Shane. I think I used a mod for it. A year or two ago. Okay. Any tips for someone starting Valley for the first time 1.6? Yep, just play the game and have fun. There's You don't, you don't need to look up mods or anything, or, um, guides or anything. Just play it. It's easy to understand. Just, uh, discovering things is one of the fun parts about this game. I like it. Oh, the children. Mom will let me have any more gummies today. Hi. Hi. Hello, I'm Penny. Penny's a very popular wife in the game. She's very sweet lady. Although when you date, if you marry Penny, Pam becomes your mother-in-law. It's like, uh-oh. Out of there. Welcome to Stardew Valley Carlos office. It's embarrassing. The previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display. But I'm hoping to remember that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts materials out there, would you let me know? You like Abigail? Abigail's a good one, too. Actually, what was that book there? book missing here. Oh. A missing books, huh? Let me see what's in there. Oh my god, we got a breadstick from the garbage bin. Delicious. Locked. Just logged. It's 4 p.m. now. Farm something? I have no money. Don't you be zooming around the trailer when I'm out. You got it? Ooh, Jojo Mart. Uh-oh. Welcome to Jojo Mart. How are you doing today? <laughs> I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris, Jojo Customer Satisfaction Representative. When you decide you want to become a Jojo member, I'll be delighted to make your transition a joyous experience. Right... Oh, let me talk to you behind the counter. Hello. Shane's working hard, doesn't be interested in talking. Jojo Mart seems so, like, cold and harsh. It's like the Walmart of this town. Gossera, thank you for that 28 month resub. Can I do it right now? Yes! Update it now. It's great. Yeah, my supermarket is so much better than all these people's supermarket. Ooh, I love the new waterfall. Beautiful. Until he redid all those and they look pretty. Uh, what is this? This is new. I don't recognize this. What is this? Ooh, new area. Yeah, we'll find out what that is, I guess, at some point. Probably festival related. Or an altar for sacrifices. One or the other. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, Willie wanted me to go to the beach. Let's go to the beach down here. Before I forget. Hope it gives me that fishing rod. Good source of money. Bum, 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 bum. I forgot to see if anything in the beach has changed at all. Uh, Willie is down on the dock. Huh. 
Hi, Willie. Hi there. Nice to see young folk moving in the valley. It's not the common these days. Visit um, before 5 p.m. Oh, darn. It's too late. I'll come back tomorrow, Willie. I missed it. I don't have a fishing rod yet, so I can't fish. I need him to give me the, his rod. Is there anything in here? No. How about here? Carrot seeds. Ooh. I found some seeds. One carrot seed. I don't remember seeds coming from those before, so that's new. Yeah, one new crop. Wait a minute. I'm trying to remember. Were carrots in the game? I don't know if I remember carrots. They're new. Okay, yeah. I was like, I don't think I remember carrots. I don't think about it. So that's something that's new. Wait, wait, wait. Listen really closely. Maybe turn up your volume. I think I hear... In the background, do you hear that noise? I'm sorry. I don't know. Such a weird sound. <laughs> Chad is not impressed. <laughs> All right. So we got one carrot. And then we shall water that one carrot. All right. Let's see. Okay. Uh, chop. Oh, that's right. Carrots came fr were drops from some creatures in the cave. You couldn't grow them, but you could find some, like, as a drop. Some, like, a cave carrot, I think is what it was. Yeah, cave carrots. But not actual real carrots. That is that is new. So we're finding that new content. Yeah, they were good in a pinch to, like, eat. And you can also make some recipes with them. It's so dark at night. Can't see a thing. I'm trying to use up all that energy I got. Perfect. Uh, he gave um, a lot of modders access to the build early so they could update their mods. So a lot of your mods will still work if you update each mod beforehand. Okay, let's go to bed. This is such a comfy looking little house. I love this start here. Looks nice. Neutral luck today. I love rainy days, no water required. Ooh, chickens are alive. I mean, I mean, I know they're alive, but I mean, chickens are grown. I felt shocked that they were alive. I'm like, what? <laughs> My inventory is full, so I couldn't um, pick it up. I will save my garbage for recycling. <laughs> they grew really fast. The, those chickens grew up super fast. Yay, our first egg. You got to tell them you love them each day. Okay, they can't go outside today, unfortunately. Uh, we need to go talk to Willie and try to get our fishing rod. Wait a minute. The brand new chickens already have gold and silver star eggs. 
That must be what the bluegrass does, is it makes their um, quality go up, like, a lot. So that's cool. We can sell these and get a little money from Pierre as well. Yeah, it seemed like they mature faster, too. They like they went from an egg, they went from a baby to a full-grown chicken really quick. Uh, Pierre, are you open today? Uh, need amethyst. Closed on Wednesdays. You would be closed on Wednesdays, Pierre. You would be, wouldn't you? Let me go sell these eggs because I need, uh, money. I... Now, correct me if I'm wrong, chat, but... I find the mini game for fishing to be fine. I don't hate it. In fact, I like it. I know everyone thinks I'm crazy, but I find the mini game to be fine. I think it's fun. Sure, it can be a little annoying sometimes, but overall, I think I like it. Oh, and thank you guys so much for being here today. Like, there's a lot of you today. So thank you for hanging out and joining Stardew Valley with me. You guys could be many other places, but you chose to be here, so thank you. For giving me your very valuable time. I appreciate it. You guys are wonderful. Uh, Sparky, thank you for that resub as well. Always check the garbage. Damn playing Stardew is the best. Well, I'm glad you enjoy. Very nice says, I like the fishing as well. Me too. I think it's great. Oh, I'm at the first item in the old cottage. Grammy's complaining about the rickety old bed, but deep down, they actually love that house. All right, now I need to go to Willie. I would love your old fishing rod. We can go fishing. A bamboo pole. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. My shop's back open now, uh, so come by if you need supplies. I'll spy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> Sir, I have a... Uh, that's a bad motto. You don't want people to bring you stuff that smells. I, I don't get that. That's not a great motto. I would work on that one. Oh, 100 gold? Yes, but Pierre's not open yet. Reach farm level 1 and craft a scarecrow. Build a silo. Hi, Willie. Um... Catfish bait. There's bait for specific animal fish now? Increase your chance to catch catfish. How much is a catfish worth? A fish smoker. That's new. Place fish inside uh, with a piece of coal to create a smoked fish. Which is worth double. The quality of the fish is preserved. Ooh. That's new. Sea jelly, river jelly, and cave jelly as well. So there's a lot of new ingredients. I'm going to buy this catfish bait. Wait a minute. Each one? Oh, no. I, I thought it was like...
I don't think this tool uses bait. Uh-oh. I don't have... I bought the bait, but I can't use it. Because it doesn't have a bait slot. Ugh. Oh, no. Minus 40, lol. Let's see what we can find on the ocean over here. A sardine! Our first catch! A silver one. The bar gets bigger with the better uh, pull you have. I believe that's how that works. Uh, all these sounds, guys. This is my happy place. Uh, fishing in the rain, hearing that like creepy ghost frog thing in the background. It's good. Anchovy. It's my comfy, happy place. Have you been to the mine yet? No. I think the mine opens a few days from now. We'll get like a notification that it's open. Careful. Careful. What was it? Flounder? Okay, another one. I'm out of space. Oh, no. A herring. If it was red, I'd be suspicious. You know those red herrings. Hopefully we can find another carrot seed. That was it. Oh, hello, emo man. Oh, you just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you chose Pelican Town? Yeah. So what? Sebastian. Only elite friends can enter uninvited. Oh, there's a shell there. Inventory full. No. No. <laughs> oh, Chad, I forgot the struggles of Stardew Valley with only having one inventory bar. You even get to that point in this game where even with four lines of inventory, you still struggle with inventory. <laughs> You're like, oh, God, there's so much stuff to hold. Oh, man. I need to sell everything and put everything else in a chest. Don't have room for any of this. Who's your favorite romance character? Oh, um, I like Leah. I know she's boring to a lot of people, but I like her. She's nice. She's very kind. She's pretty. She's like she's like an all-around great person. I find her very pleasant to hang around. Watering can. I don't need my hoe for this. Pickaxe, bamboo pole. I don't think I need the scythe. Actually, there's grass. What's new in the new update? Uh, too many items to list. If you want to read the patch notes, you can. But he recommends just doing a new playthrough without spoiling yourself on what's new. Just play and you'll discover things on your own. But it's a monstrous update with lots of stuff. Lots of stuff. All right, let's go on this way. So this new update adds, it's free and adds like lots and lots of stuff. Uh, whereas 1.5 focus on the island that they added, this one focuses on the old game, um, the old areas of the game to fill them in, to add more stuff, to make them feel more complete. Yeah, the, the meadow has a mix of green grass and blue grass. I wish it was all blue grass. We'll have to, like, remove the green. This one's not biting, is it? 
Algae. Are you going to uh, do JoJo or Community Center? I can't bring myself to do JoJo. It's so mean. It's so like, it's like the evil playthrough. It's like uh, in Mass Effect. I can never do Paragon because, I can never do Renegade because Paragon's just so nice. I like to be nice to people. I always tell myself I'm doing an evil playthrough and then I, I, I feel bad after doing one evil choice and then I end up going back to a good playthrough again. Anyone else in chat do that? <laughs> You're like, I'm gonna do an evil playthrough. Oh, I feel bad. I'm sorry. Oh, let's talk to the wizard. The wonderful wizard of the woods. Locked. You can hear someone inside, though. Okay. Can't talk to him yet. Uh, rainy days are so peaceful. I love the sound of the rain. Stardew Valley is the ultimate comfy sit back and relax game. Very low pressure. Unless you gave yourself pressure by giving yourself a million things to do each day. It's very relaxing, very comfy. Oh, these the new the redone waterfalls are glorious. Look at those. Those are beautiful. He did such a good job with that. You can tell he's working on his art. He's he's working on his pixel art skills with Haunted Chocolatier and is getting better at doing it and just making it even more pretty. I bet you that's how this update started was he was just like, man, I wish Stardew Valley had this level of stuff. Wait a minute, I'll do an update. The Stardew Valley Expanded uh, Mod Creator worked on the update as well. Really? He had help. Well, that's amazing. There are some mods that I just wish were part of the base game. Like the mod that lets you see where people are. What's that? Only a master of the five ways may enter. Is that new? Only a master of the five ways may enter. Huh. That's new content. Ooh. Master of the Five Ways. Hmm. Maybe they mean like Waffle House, where you get a five, you get your um, hash browns done in five ways. Or Skyline Chili, where you get a five way, yeah. How many skills are there in the game? There are one, two, three, four, five ways. They said something about mastery. So if you become a master of the skills in the game, you probably unlock special bonuses and stuff. Interesting. I'm curious what that system's going to be like. There's so many ways that he could implement it. Watch it be a, a Kung Fu Panda crossover. <laughs> you know, I could see that. I could. Oop, let's grab this. Can I go into the community center yet? Nope, locked. Okay, more daffodils. These are good to sell. I forgot my hoe to get the worms. I have to come back for the with my hoe. Okay, that's locked. So let's go grab let's go pick up my hoe and come back. There's one there to hoe as well. I put my hoe away to try to save some space, but now I need my hoe. And then I don't have my hoe when I need it the most. You know how it goes, the story of my life. You think you're done with your hoe and then you end up needing it. Let me go ahead and sell all this stuff. Actually, I'm going to keep some. Some of this stuff is used for recipes. I can't remember which ones, but some of them are. I will store those, and then 
I will grab my hoe. There we go. Oh no, I gotta do this in the dark. <laughs> Faux show, sure, exactly. Okay, let's see what's in here. A rock. Great. Not my first choice. Not my first choice of item, but I'll take it. And then there was a worm. Oh, God. I remember seeing it. Maybe it despawned. I'm crazy, but there was one right here. And now it's gone. I don't see it anymore. Wait, you got some new ideas to sleep on just popped up. Huh? I just got a pop-up that said, you got some new ideas to sleep on after picking up that horseradish. I wonder what that means. Oh, oh, it's uh, probably, I leveled up for uh, foraging. That's what it is. They let you know now with a pop-up that you leveled it up. Okay, where was um, the worms? Oh, right here. A stone? All that for a stone? <laughs> no! Uh, I know, it's very dark at night. All that work for a stone? I'm sad. Alright, let's sleep and see what that does for us. Get in bed for midnight. It was up by the fountain somewhere. Okay, thank you for the reminder, Ali. Exciting, very dog. I know. We love new content. Oh, foraging. Yep. Trees sometimes drop seeds, axe proficiency, wild seeds, a field snack. So the eggs sold for not much, but a little bit. All right, 300 bucks. Not bad. Could be a, a bed blueprint. Hello, Robert Weeks. All right, let's go ahead and... Oh, we got a letter. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does it sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Uh, stop by Pierre's today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. How did he know I desperately need that? Like, desperately. Is he spying on me? Okay, let's water all of our crops. He's definitely watching. Pierre would be the type to watch me and then order stuff based on my habits. Oh, the little pond's not there. Where is the nearest water source to fill my bucket with? Okay, it's not down. Um, let's try left. So this is the new um, meadow farm layout. You see, a lot of the farm is covered in grassland like this with trees and stuff, so you can't uh, farm there. All right. Uh, oh. Oh, there's my water. Let's fill it up. It is very cute, but there is a lot of the area that cannot be farmed. So have to keep that in mind when you're planning your layouts that only certain sections of it can actually have crops. And only certain sections can actually have grass that your animals can eat. Mm -hmm. Can't wait for starting to come out on my Switch. I know. It's going to be great. We finally get the... Uh, people on console get the update, too. What is bluegrass for? It's for um, keeping um, people that like banjos very happy and dancing. Bluegrass is a very... Uh, Upbeat style of music. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> okay, let's throw all that in there. What? <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> okay, um. 
I don't need my watering can, so let's put that away. Did I finish watering everything, though? I think I did. Looks like it. Let's go to Pierre's and see if I can get some money. Oh my god, thank you for the donuts, little T+. Plus. Thank you so much on the TikTok stream. I'm going to sell everything because I need money at this stage. I need all the money to get seeds so they can get more money. <laughs> Let's see if there's anything to pick up to sell. Uh, I'm not sure who we're gonna who we're gonna um, save who we're gonna date yet. We'll see. I'm not sure. There's quite a couple options out there. We'll see. Maybe we'll let chat vote on it. Maple seed. Willie? I don't think Willie's dateable. Maybe he is now, but I don't think he is currently. All right, sell all that. We got a little bit of money. Let's go cauliflower. I think cauliflower sells for a good amount. Oh, we'll go for our, you know, our parsnips as well. So that parsnips are cheap but they are good at what they are chance of mar multiple potatoes could get a few of these kale jazz seeds let's go with diversity we want as much of different types as possible i think that's it for now Shmi the Fiend, thank you for that Prime Gaming sub. Appreciate that. Night Fury, thank you for following on the TikTok stream. Appreciate that. Thank you so much. Okay, let's go plant some seeds and get them all watered and stuff. I got to be careful. If I give myself too many seeds, it's going to be a nightmare in the morning to get everything watered. Uh, any idea what's up the huge tree by Marnie's farm? Wait, there's a huge tree? I didn't even notice it. Let me go look at it. I, if there was a tree there, I completely did not see that. One, two, three. Nope. We'll do... Two, three, four. Okay, row eight. And then another row of eight. And that keeps the symmetry, which we love. Symmetry. We love organized crops. Isn't that just the we oh, yeah. oh no. I need more money. I have to have 120 more monies to get some more stuff. Otherwise it will be unsymmetrical and chat will laugh. And we can't have that. I must have I must keep symmetry because you guys when you're playing no one's looking over imagine some imagine someone looking over your shoulder being like Really? You're, make, you're, you're making your crop like that? That's me times 6,000 right now. <laughs> so, 6,000 people are like, really? Right there? Really? Potatoes? Hmm. Well, that's a choice. <laughs> There's a radish behind me? Oh, where was it? It's like, oh, well, I guess you could put it there. Oh, it was behind, radish behind a pine tree. Oh, was there? Oh my God. It looks like a tree topper. <laughs> you guys are so good at spotting that. I did not see that. That was thank you, chat. You guys are amazing. That was a very good find. Tribolite. Ooh, that's a fo that's a fossil. Bum, 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 bum. I feel like there's a lot more worms now than there used to be. Stranger, hello. Don't mind me. I live out here all alone. Dun, dun, dun. 
dun, dun, dun. I am always very impressed by how good Chad is at spotting things that I don't see. You guys are just have impeccable eyes. Every single line I've scrolled through is Stardew. I hope it's good. Yes. Uh, lots of people are playing Stardew right now because of the big updates out. Uh, let's see. One second. What is this big update? Uh, they add lots and lots of little things, sometimes some bigger things, to the old part of the game. So as you're playing, you'll discover new areas, new secrets, new items, um, people named John, you like all kinds of stuff at randomly. Yes, I love lattes. Yeah, uh, if you if you want to not be spoiled by what new content there is and stay away from the reddit right now because there's lots of people posting all kinds of spoilers there so be careful about that i tried playing but uh 25 of my mods are broken Ooh, uh have you updated all the mods because they might release updates today to fix them so make sure that like you've updated your mods and also check compatibility not every mod is usable with the um with the new uh update yeah, there's uh, apparently 130,000 people playing Stardew Valley again, which is amazing. Uh, he recommends starting a new playthrough, yes. You can continue on your old state, but you might get bombarded with new stuff right away. Um, and it's fun to just discover things as you're playing. But you can do whatever you want. It's your game. Abysmal, not a single piece in the entire collection. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Thank you for the follows, T and second winning. Appreciate that. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this in great detail, but it's yours. Hmm, I got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any of your artifacts or materials that you find? Make ground make a discovery together. And who knows, if you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Think about it, will you? Decide to donate, just bring the items to the front of the desk. to the museum put that there and that there oh 250 gold that'll help a lot I think Pierre just closed his shop though unfortunately ah oh, bad timing we might have to wait till tomorrow uh, the council version will come when it comes it just depends on how long he can get it approved we don't know when he submitted it for ver for a certification or not. Because on console, you have to get all your patches approved by the consoles first. It's annoying. It's it's weird. But yeah, that's how it works. The new farmer we've all been expecting. And whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Well, thank you. Da, da. 
Yeah, mods are gonna take a little time to like, you know, get tweaked and stuff. For sale. 2,000 bucks? Oh no. Is your shop open or no? Looks like it's not open. I'll have to wait. Elliot's your first husband, dude. Ooh. He kind of reminds me of like the guy on the cover of a romance novel. That like suave, dapper, very muscular, stable boy. <laughs> very Fabio, yeah. Fabio. Luscious, flowing hair. Uh, give me one second. <laughs> One second. Okay, one second. Oh, Echo. Sorry, I'm fixing something real fast. Oh, well. Okay, let's see. Well, I, I'll have to wait till tomorrow for some of those things. Let's, uh, I'll store them in here just to get rid of them. I need the money. We'll buy the stuff tomorrow. All right, next day. Sleep for the night. I can see Neil Newborn voicing uh, Elliot. Yes, the Starian voice. That would be perfect. A little, a little deeper tone, probably. I think, and he'd have it perfect. But that definitely that like the inflection and mannerism and stuff would be great. Oh my god, our cat! Hello, Dan. You see this cat here? I found it sitting outside the entrance to your little farm. I think it's a stray, poor little thing. I think it likes this place. Do you think this farm could use a good cat? Yes. Her name is definitely Tifa. Well, little Tifa, uh, you'll be a good kitty now, okay? So it's just like my cat. You need to pick one of the new cats? No, because my cat's orange and I can't have a different cat. She wouldn't like that. Uh, to our value Jojo Mart customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation in the mountain lake. I'd remind you that drilling operation entirely legal. Responsible stewardship to the local environment is the top priority. Always for any convenience, this action may have caused. It's always we value community support and patronage. Jojo. Joja. Huh. Sure. I bet Jojo Joja cares. They care so much. So much. I forgot to pet my chickens and let them out. Uh oh. They're gonna be mad. Wow, they're laying all kinds of eggs. Lucky I had extra hay in there. Okay, they can come out and play. Eat the bluegrass as well. Carrots ready already? Hmm. A fast growing colorful tuber that makes for a great snack. Okay then. Uh, that grew really fast, I feel like. Oh, I was gonna um, grab something. Let's go sell these. I, I need my um, watering can, that's what we need. Um, watering can, oh. 
Yes, there we go. Yeah, the new farm starts with chickens, which is great. Gives you a nice little source of income and some chickens right off the bat, which is amazing. Alright, beautiful, beautiful. You forgot carrot seed behind Linus. Oh, thank you. I'll go take a look. grab this. We gotta get all the things we can to sell to Pierre. Okay, let me go to Pierre first. Sell, and then come back. Uh, I'm trying to use my Prime, so it won't let me. Um, They kind of hid the button. It's still there. But it's kind of hidden now. You have to like do a drop-down. If it doesn't work, make sure that your, pri your Amazon Prime is still active. Sometimes, like a pay they'll like a credit card will expire and they don't update it and stuff. So check that as well. Oh, thank you. Alrighty then. Oh, hi there. Rocket Watson, Ruginator. Oh, he didn't. Thank you for those resubs, guys. Never played. Any advice how to start? Yep, just install the game and start playing. Uh, they teach, they give you the mechanics little by little, so you can slowly learn how to play. There's no need to like know everything ahead of time. You'll learn just by playing. Uh, so it's fun just to try things out and see how it is. New farm comes with coops and chicken. That's wild. It is. This is the Pelican Town Community Center, and what's left of it anyway. Used to be the pride and joy of the town. Always bustling activity. Yeah, this game is really good at, like, very slowly introducing new mechanics. So you don't have to worry about getting overwhelmed. It's very simple at first. You just start with clearing the brush, talking to people, and planting the crops. Cody's Bath, welcome back to with the Prime sub. Appreciate that. Rocket Watson with those bits. Thank you so much. You're awesome. Thank you for just throwing a little love my way. Uh, these days, young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. No, Grandpa. They want to sit on Twitch. Thank you. Or TikTok or YouTube. Unlike you, right? <laughs> But listen to me, I sound like an old fool. Is it just me, or I had more fun staying inside and playing video games than I ever had going outside and playing football or baseball or or roughhousing with people. Like I always had a lot more fun staying inside playing video games. It wasn't fun to go outside and play with other people. It wasn't great for I don't know. I never got the appeal. Let me stay inside on a sunny day and play my video games. And I'm happy. I'm a happy camper. Jojo Corporation has been hounding me to sell them land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Funtown used to be, uh, could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me got attached to relics of the past. I'm going to buy Jojo Co. membership. I'm just going to go ahead and sell it. Here, let's go inside. I loved outside way more as a kid, but that changed eventually. Yeah, there's different folk, different strokes for different folks. I hate that expression. Hmm, <laughs> what's this? I guess Vincent and Joss uh, must be playing in here. Plays even more dilapidated, I remember. What? Am I tripping or did I see a little creature? Uh, okay. What's the matter? Are you ill? I 
You saw something. Hmm, I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. <laughs> You're worrying me, Dan. Look, I think I'm just gonna head home. I need some lunch. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can catch that rat if you have some extra time. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it's just a rat. That's all it is. Already noticing some of the new dialogue. Yeah, he added a bunch of new dialogue to the game, too. Little things here and there to, like, make things a little more clear. Um, is there? Okay, there's the first one right there. Let's see what the community center wants. I don't know what that says. I think I hit my head before I tried to read that. Hmm. Okay. Very interesting. <laughs> All right, uh, let's go ahead and sell it, Pierre, and then get some more seeds to even out our crops. Forgot how good the music is. I know, every time I boot up the game, I'm just like blown away. I love how every season has different music, too. I need two cauliflower seeds, two potato seeds, have a little bit more money. Ah, uh, not enough though. Three, four, five, six. I'm gonna get all the cauliflower. Cauliflower I think sells for a bunch. Have we read the patch notes? No, that he recommends not reading them because there's a lot of spoilers in there. But if you don't mind spoilers, go ahead and read the whole patch notes. But I'm saving myself for... I'm, sa I'm trying not to get spoiled by too many things. I looked at it a little bit just to get a little taste of how big they were, but it's a lot of stuff. A lot of new stuff. It's going to be fun. Hello, Moose Master. All right, grab that. Maybe get one of the giant cauliflowers. Oh, I forgot about that. I think... I forget what the requirements are, but there's some requirement to get the big one to appear. Alright, 14. Hmm. Okay, his first two potatoes. Get those all planted. And then 14 would be... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Oh my god, I am a genius. So if I put this here, even though I got 14, it is even. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. Perfectly symmetrical. I love it. <laughs> we did it, Chad. We did it. Go us. We are the puzzle master. I love having symmetrical farms. It makes me so happy. Oh no, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to go refill for one square, aren't I? <laughs> no! Always one square. 
It was so close to being perfect. All down this way. Trying to get to the water is like playing pachinko on the prices, right? It's like trying to get over there. There we go. Go to your sink? Wait, you can refill at the sink? In the house? Rain, are you serious? Oh wait, I don't have a sink yet. <laughs> yeah. It probably works, I just don't have one yet. I have like a little cabin. So I did so you can you can fill up at the sink in your house? I had no idea that you could do that. That's amazing. Thanks for the tip. Tifa. Give you some encouragement. Okay, now we got some actual crops happening. This is good. Let's go ahead and get rid. Let's use all our energy each day to get this like fully cleared and empty of riffraff. Get rid of these seeds that are popping up over here. You guys fill up by the waterfall. Oh, thank you. Let's get rid of this, even though it's pretty. <laughs> Scarecrow? Uh, have we... Let's see, maybe. No, I, I haven't quite unlocked it yet. So we can't do it just yet. Text sign. Hmm. What is the text sign? Oh, I don't have a space for it. Not the photo over there for now. Apparently there's a new item called the big chest. Which is like double the size. Which should um, be nice. All right, uh, let's see what's on, what we can put on this little sign here. Um, Dan, Dan crazy. Oh, so I walk past it and it just, it'll pop up what it says. That's awesome. Boom. I like it. Updates only PC for now. Yes, Cheyenne. Unfortunately, because it takes consoles a while to get uh, patches approved. Otherwise, he would upload it instantly. Uh, pick a poop. Sorry, sorry. Pick a moop. Thank you for the love and one three sub. It says, yay. I can tell you're having a blast time, Dan. Love Stardew. Me too. Thank you for watching. And thank you for... 11 months, you're almost at one year. That's amazing. Thank you so much. Okay, grab that and then do this and that. And pop, pop. And let's go ahead and pop that. Get all this clear out. So this, like, this is going to be one of the only places that we can grow crops for a, a big radius around our house because there's so much grass here that can't be altered. You know what? I bet someone will make a mod to make this um, twist like that. <laughs> Alright, and then chop this down. What farm type is this? It's a cool farm. <laughs> no, it's it's the new... There's a new uh, farm type called Meadow Farm. Uh, this is the that just launched with the update where it comes with a chicken coop. You start with some chickens, which is amazing. Let me go grab the hay and put it in there. Okay, let me grab this hay. It also has this special bluegrass here that really makes them ha super happy. Oh, so silo required. Okay, fill it up. Okay, we are uh, out of energy, but I think the hot spring opened. So we can go up there and rest our weary bones because we're old. Yeah, you don't have to be the chickens if you uh, open the door each day. The new meadow map is really pretty. It's got like the best of everything. It's got a river. It's got, you start with a coop. It's got all kinds of great stuff on it. I think it's gonna be a great map. 
<gasps> Carrot seeds. Yes. Yes. Oh, there's a a leak there. <coughs> I can swing two more times. Wait. So that's not open. Yeah, it, the hot spring isn't open yet. Never mind. I thought it was open, but it's not. Okay. Two. <gasps> there was two seeds, but one of them fell in the water. No. Ah. Oh. That sucks. Uh, foraging doesn't cost any energy, thankfully, like picking up stuff off the ground. Proven adventurers only. The Adventurers Guild. That needs repaired as well. That looks different. Something's there. This is how I found your stream originally playing Stardew Valley years ago. Well, thank you. No trespassing, I know. Oh, what's in here? Oh, this is where we get our sword. Huh. I was just peering down this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. Here, take this. It's dangerous to go alone. <laughs> okay, I changed that line to make it Zelda. I'm sorry. Sue me. No! No, Nintendo! No! I was kidding! Stop! No! Uh, name's Marlin, by the way. I ran the Adventurers Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. I know they're going to think that I'm an emulator of Zelda. <laughs> I have no energy. Best I can do would be able to pick something up, but nope. Leave the mine. Well, we got our sword now, which is great. <laughs> okay, um, we should probably head back. We are completely out of energy. Can't really do much now. Nintendo will cancel that sponsorship. I don't know if Nintendo does. They're like, they don't do influencer stuff very much. It's very rare. They do occasionally. Seem to pick people that almost exclusively do Nintendo stuff. If at all. I, I rarely ever see them, like, doing anything. You want that cat treat? Oh, this one? Oh, yeah, this one is really nice. It's from a company called Mao, M-A-U. It's uh, one of the best cat trees I've ever had. All right, let's go ahead and go to bed. Aw, Tifa's on the bed. Oh, that's adorable. Let's go ahead and sell, because I need the money for now. Okay, and let's go sleep for the night. Perfect. Cats love to sleep on the bed with you. Like, they like to usually sleep by your head or your feet. <laughs> My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why not? Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the uh, forest lake and the stone tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. M. Rasmidus, wizard. My rat problem, huh? How would he know about that? That is suspicious. 
I'll we'll story see until I have more of them. Can I be right back for a second, guys? I'm gonna run the bathroom real fast. Sorry, I was uh, chatting with Kevin for a second. Okie dokie. Uh, Kevin just got back. All right, uh, let's go ahead and get our watering done first. Uh, let's see, water. Until I get those sprinklers, we're going to be watering a bunch. All right, boom. Uh, Kevin was just dealing with the dealership that uh mechanic today and it was fun hours of fun okay there we go uh basically yesterday we had <laughs> he was calling all day Trying to get someone to answer the damn phone of the dealership to check on the car that we um, we bought a, bought a new car uh, last couple weeks ago, and the check engine light came on it, so we had to leave it over there over the weekend, and we just could not get anyone to answer the phone on Monday, so we finally had to go over there. He went over today to talk to someone in person. Yeah, it's the worst. Like he would just call and call and let it ring and ring, and no one answered the phone all day, all Monday. 
All right. Uh, everything's watered? Yeah, okay. Let's go ahead and... Who are we missing? Pam, Linus, Alex, Willie, Gus. The wizard? Oh, Leah. Um, the old lady as well. I can't remember where she is. Da, 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 da. All right. Okay, nothing there. Let's go forward. Michelle, thank you for that follow on the TikTok stream. Appreciate that. Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a uh, thing right there. Well, there's a lot more worms now than there used to be in the game. Oh, we didn't go uh, to Robin and her family. I think that's who we're missing. Also, Leah, who should be over here somewhere. Oh, hi, Willie. What are you doing here? Love fishing scene, but more likely to expand my shop stock. It's locked. Yep, this is the new Stardew Valley update. There's lots and lots of little things that are new in the game. Recommend just playing on a new save and check them out. You can even do the new map they added, the new farm type, which you start with a coop and chickens. I forgot to let the chickens out. Oops. That reminds me, I gotta go let the chickens out. Oopsie. I keep forgetting about that. Can you fill up your water in the river by the chickens? Yeah. Uh, that is a place you can do that. It's also very pretty because it's like, uh, it's uh, rip, uh, well, there's a waterfall right there now. This new layout's very beautiful. Let's go over here and let the chickens out. And there's the bluegrass. Let me grab these eggs. Tell the chickens that we love them. There you go. Keep the door closed on them. But well, they're pretty good about not coming out of there. For now, at least. Mm -hmm. All right, um, let's go to the north and try a little bit of the cave, I think. Not much, I don't have much energy, but just a little bit. I just grabbed Stardew. I don't know how I feel about it. Uh, it starts a little slow, but it starts building on mechanics really quickly, so it will get very complex the further you get into the game. Two carrot seeds, nice. Starts out a little slow, a little light, but as you're playing, more and more and more features start unlocking, and it starts to get crazy. So give it a chance. It'll, it'll get there for you. And there's a reason why it's one of the most beloved indie games uh, of the past 10 years. Just really good. Hello. I met a run on town that's exhausting. Oh, um, her husband. Demetrius. Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Some local plants here. Uh from my home laboratory. I met my daughter, Maru. She's interested to meet you. You know my dad, Demetrius? He's a scientist. I have a lot of fun helping him out in the laboratory. Interesting place for a laboratory. Okay. I haven't met the wizard, Leah, that lady, that child, and the old lady. What if I think one of them is around here. I can't remember where, the, where she is. Shane's in the basement, I believe. Cause he's emo. Crazy cool, thank you for that resub. It's so nice of you. Who are the plants already? Yes, I always do that first because if I don't do it first, I'll forget. I need to make sure I have the energy for that each day as well. All right, let's go down. Uh, the old lady should be in her home here with Alex. She sometimes is there, sometimes she's not. There she is, okay. Why, hello. Welcome to our community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. All right. Not starting the day with watering plants is objectively wrong. 
if you don't start every day by watering your plants, I do question your um, order of operations. It does seem a little suspicious. I like her too. She's nice. If you become her friend, she gives you cookies, which that's how you win my friendship is give me cookies. I'll be your friend. Dried starfish. Ooh. Yep, new save file. They re he recommends playing a new save file because there's so many new mechanics. Uh, you'll get swamped with them if you just go right from an old save into the new one. Uh, I, did, I said order of operations because last time I was playing um, Final Fantasy 7 and there's this uh, mini game where you organize an AI um, a robot's AI to operate in a certain order so my brain went order of operations from that there is like a bubble thing there what was that dun, 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 dun. and it is small mouth bass you know what this gives me um, remind reminders of is, do you remember when um, Animal Crossing first launched in, in um, 2020 and we were all playing it all at the same time? That was good. I like making my own clothes, but it's not easy to get cloth. Okay. Hi, do you too. Uh, Leah should be around her house, probably. Let's go chat with her. I don't know. Actually, she might. Let's see if she's in there. Nope. Not yet, at least. want to start this game, but it's scary how deep it is. It's really, it's really easy in the beginning because there's not much to do. Just all you have to do in the beginning is just... Water your crops a little a little bit and talk to people. It's very light. And they slowly introduce mechanics over time. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is this? That what is this? This is new. That is a giant tree that wasn't wasn't there before. That's like a redwood. Yeah, that's that's very new. Okay, then. That's a big, big tree. Probably full of big, big mysteries, too. And you can't spell mystery without tree. Mr. Tree. Mr. Tree. Mystery. Ah, come in. I'm Rasmodeus, seeker of the arcane truths, mediator between physical and ethereal, master of the seven elementals, keeper of the sacred cha. You get the point. And you, Dan, these, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. Here, I'd like to show you something. Behold. You've seen one before, have you? Not. They call themselves Junimos. Mysterious spirits, these ones. For some reason, they refuse to speak with me. Not sure why they moved to the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. I like the Junimos. They're they're cute. McZim, thank you for that twenty-one month resub. I can't like just do the the JoJo place and make them not my friends. I don't. I just can't do that. It seems too mean. Most interesting. Bum, 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 bum. 
Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. What the hell? <laughs> I found the note. Language was obscure, but I was able to decipher it. Uh, we, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Pick my spouse. Uh, do Shane. No one does Shane enough. Oh, one with the forest. What do they mean? Sniff, sniff. Aha! Come here. My cauldron is bubbling the greetings from the forest. Baby fern, moss grub, camel top, toadstool. Can you smell it? Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. That's like roaring boil, though. Plus 30 energy. Nice. Oh, God. It turned green. Uh-oh. We're going on a trip. <laughs> oh, we tripping. That's some good stuff. Not the first time a guy in a robe gives me something to drink in the woods and then I start hallucinating. Pretty standard nowadays. Gain the power of the forest magic, you can now decipher the meaning of Junimo Scrolls. Oh, that's a nice trip. <laughs> hey, it happens. It happens. I can now paint with all the colors of the wind as well. I don't know what that means, but I can do that. Look, our, our inventory is full. I need to empty it. Let me go turn in this thing to the museum real fast, though. All right, run across all the way over there. I don't think I talked to her. Hello. You smell like grass. <laughs> How did she know? <laughs> How did she know that? Okay. She got me. I'm wrecked. I I busted by a little girl. She knew. Oh, 6 p.m. at close already. Darn. I'll have to come back tomorrow with it. I don't like getting called out like that. She's got a lot of nerve. A young lady. Mary Emily, she has a bird. Ooh. Emily gives you a bird in your house? I do like birds. Although Tifa's a cat, and cat and birds don't usually mix very well. All right, let's um, sell all this stuff. I'm going to plant. I'm going to put these uh, carrots away over here. I'll store that there for tomorrow. Well. I'll sell these eggs as well. Perfect. You want to tell them about the zoom in and out function? Yeah. Uh, I. You can uh, even turn on the buttons if you want. Uh, we have some extra energy. I should probably use it for something. We don't have much energy, just a little. Let me close their little gate thing here. Water the cat. Oh, you mean the bowl. I was like, not the cat. The cat's... <laughs> She's just sitting there sleeping and I just pour water on her. 
She would love that so much. Okay, let's um I'm gonna go in the mine very briefly just to do a little bit and then we shall come back. Oh man. Forgot how slow the lowest um level of pick is. Oh, it's bad. Oh, we got a copper ore and a geode. Is it going to be the last? It's going to be the last stone. It's our luck, isn't it, chat? Oh, there it is, finally. Dun, 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 dun. I like to spelunk when I have a little extra time. Got extra energy. Not gonna get very far, but I might be able to get to level 10, maybe. If I'm lucky. Oh, that music is gorgeous. A lot of copper early. Let me go ahead and chop all this though. Um, I have no room for any of this. No! Uh, okay, I'll grab the copper and then we'll get out of here. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna get late. I gotta go. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> oh, there's that thing. I need that. Ah. Uh. It's fine. I need rocks right now because it's very early game and I don't have very many, so I will need them for now. Okay, now we got to run. How's the update, uh, Murder Taco? It is very good. Adds lots of nice little stuff so far. A lot of little things. Uh, we, we've barely begun, so we've only seen just a little taste. There's quite a few new areas that I don't know what it does yet, which is exciting. So there's going to be secrets to uncover as we get further and further into the game. Oh, we're running. I'm running. I don't know if I'll be able to make it. Well, we're definitely going to not have full energy tomorrow, but we'll at least get there before 2. Before we go to bed. Damn crazy. Okay, go back. Tifa, go to sleep for the night. Uh, fishing proficiency, mining proficiency. Hell yeah. Uh, chat, if I, um, have something that, a fact that may make you feel a little bit old. This game came out eight years ago. Yep, this game is eight years old. Two more years is going to be a decade old. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just realized that, so I needed you to realize it too. <laughs> no. I'm mad I started on PlayStation, not PC. Oh, I'm sorry. It's on sale on PC right now. It's 20% off if you want to give it a whirl. So it's pretty cheap. Hi there. Good morning. Looks like you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. Want to get the most of your ore you find? You'll need a furnace. So happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying right here. I want you to have them. Oh, thank you. Whoa, is that that's a new blueprint design? That looks amazing. That's a new model for blueprint, right? That looks really nice. Thanks, Dan. You're welcome. <laughs> Can we marry Clint in this update? I don't know. I, I don't know what the new um, romance options are or not allowed. When you smelted a few copper bars, considering having me upgrade one of your tools, I can make um, your work a lot easier. Heading home, take it easy. 
Yep, still one of the best games. Oh, 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 no. Still an amazing game, yes. <laughs> okay, first we water, as always. The upgrades in this game do make a drastic difference. Uh, we don't know when the update will hit the other platforms, but PC is today. We don't know about console or mobile yet. Hopefully soon. It took a long time for mobile to get 1.5, so I'm not sure how long it'll take them to get 1.6. Is the only change the new starting farm with the blue grass chickens? Uh, that's that's one of the new changes. Uh, if you want to see the full list, he, he published patch notes today. It's like 17 pages long of all the different changes to the game and rebalancing and stuff. It's a lot. This one hurts me, but Morrowind is 22 years old. Ugh. Morrowind is one of the best games ever made, though. I can't believe it's been 22 years of goodness there. Okay, let's go outside. Morrowind is still amazing. I still remember playing Morrowind on my parents' PC, and it was so weak I had to turn all the settings down, and it was always like there was a fog 10 feet from me the whole time. I could never see more than 10 feet in front of me because of that thick fog, because the render distance was all the way down. It was a great it, it game to explore the foggy world of Morrowind. Tifa? <laughs> right, modern amount of light, wild seed, cherry, text, woodpath, gate, field snack, wood fence. I played the first time in OG Xbox when I was 10 years old. Oh my. The, that was a great, that was a great game to play on Xbox. If you had, if you only had an Xbox, nothing else. It was fantastic. Hope you love an update. Yeah, it's great. Thank you for sharing the live murder taco. Appreciate that. All right, we need to. I need to store this watering can. I th I'll hold on. I'll keep my hoe with me because I gotta keep my hoe close. And. We'll take the geodes with us and see what we get out of them. Okay, we're going to stop by a couple places today. I really need money. How it... This should be blooming soon. Hopefully. I need the money. Ooh, there's a... I'm going to take a leak here. I'm going to take the dandelion. Take another leak. Yeah, Fallout London mod looks amazing. I can't wait for that one. <laughs> Sorry, Hicker. Uh, I was just taking it off the ground. It was just sitting there. Hey, George, would you like a leak? My favorite thing. Thank you. Aren't you cold? They don't make sweaters like they used to. Hi, George. Um... We gave you a gift. Excited for the Fallout TV show? My, I love everything Fallout, so yes, I am super hyped for that one. I'm really sad they took away um, the watch party right before it was about to release. That's not cool, but it is what it is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight more, okay. Oh, I have one penny left. Oops. Oopsie. Hey, who am I missing? I'm missing like one person, right? Who's that green person? Who's that? Who's that? I can't remember who these people are. I can't remember where to find them. I 
Abigail's mom. Okay. Saloon, sewer, Willow Lane, Mayor's Manor, Carpenter's Shop. Hello, um, the weather is interesting today, don't you think? Yes, Penny. Yes, it is. Let me check the beach for stuff. Oh, good, there's something there I can sell. Oh, good, a good shell day. Mm -hmm. All right, not bad. Caroline, yep. Uh, where is Caroline? It's a Sunday. I forget where all these pe people are, though. They have, like, such different schedules. Is that a mushroom there? Okay, nothing. The cozy vibes of Stardew are unlike any other game out there. It still is just really good. I forget how much wood to repair that bridge. I'll double check. I need to sell these to Pierre and then come back and then have them open my geodes if I can. Three hundred wood. Okay, thank you. It's a lot of wood. Sound like a lot of wood. Caroline is Pierre's wife. Oh. She's probably back here. There she, there she is. I just can't reach her. Altar of Yoba. Yoba. Never been religious, but hey, I'm old. <laughs> it's... You know, it's good to hedge your bets. Hedge your, hedge your bets. You know, you're old, you might as well. Okay, Caroline, just... Caroline, slow down. Caroline! The hell did she go? She ran off somewhere. Oh, she's in the shop. Okay, I'm going back. Thank you. I missed her. I forgot to sell his peer. Oh, there she's right there. Okay. He won't buy these? Well, damn. Okay. Today I'm going to just uh, relax, think about, think positively. You ever take a day off? No. Okay, just missing Leah now. Leah is the lady that likes to eat salad. She's the easiest to romance. You just give her salad every day. She's like, oh my god, salad? That's my favorite. I love salad. It's literally her favorite thing, and you can buy hundreds of it from the, the bar. It's it's great. So if, she, if you want her for a romance option, it's great. Yes, the update's out, Tasty Trees. Slay, thank you for that eight-month resub. Such good music, yes. What do you think of the new cave? I mean, the one Master Five Ways? Yeah, I don't know what that is yet. I'm still trying to figure out what that is. Oh, thank you, big uh, firmware. Thank you for the kind message. It says, I've been watching all your VODs. I absolutely love your content. Thank you for Pun Day Monday. You are welcome. How am I doing? I'm doing great, Cheese. How are you doing? Okay, I don't know where Leah is, but her house is right here. If I hang out in front of her house, she's bound to come back, right? She's got to be here, right? 
Yeah, there's a new giant, giant tree next to Marie's house. We don't know what that is yet. But there's something new there. Hmm. You know, I bought this new item yesterday that helps make... Um, that helps turn my cheese into little tiny slices, and it's just great. Okay, where is it? Okay, she's at the bar. Let's go to the bar. What should you get for lunch in Vegas? Um, you should go to George... Uh, Gordon Ramsay's uh, restaurant. It's amazing. Gordon Ramsay's restaurant in um is in front, I think it's in the Bellagio is absolutely delicious. I think at seven they go there. Go ahead and um well it's too late now so we'll have to sell everything and then go plant this cauliflower now master of five ways probably means master of each of the skills so it's probably because once you hit level 10 in your skills like that was it there's nothing else to do with them so i think he added some more stuff to do once you hit max level which sounds awesome. Three, four, five. Uh, let's see. Uh, there are there, he has two restaurants in Vegas. One of them is just bar food. Um, it's in the Bellagio, and that one's easy to get into. It's always packed, but you can get in there pretty easily. It's not the fancy restaurant where you gotta like sit down and have reservations. Just like bar level food I forget what the name of it is I went there with a uh, tally yeah he has lots of restaurants in all over the place his name is very valuable fish and chips stand too by the link yeah he's got lots of stuff everywhere Tifa are you dead or are you just very asleep She's like, uh. <laughs> she looks passed out. I don't know what that's all about, but okay. Oh, they're sleeping. Okay, I think it's time for a sleepy time. All right, next day. Uh, level one farming. Oh, we can make scarecrows now, finally. Uh, watering can proficiency and hoe proficiency. Oh, thank God. I'm better at, better at hoes. <laughs> Which is not bad. <laughs> oh, my God. A rainy day. No! The day I get the scarecrow. Mmm. I need more wood. I think that should cover everything. That son of a bitch. <laughs> Luckily, I had one, exactly one extra seed. I was just about to put that down, and then he does that. Oh. Let me grab these eggs. Tell the chickens that we love them so get more hearts going. I know crows are like tax collectors in this. They're just kind of like, mm, that's mine. Thank you. I think I will take this. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Actually, yeah, if we go down one square, I think that'd be even better. Yeah, there we go. Now we can covers more space. We can walk around a little bit better there. Uh, what's your favorite food? Probably seafood. Because I see food and I eat it. <laughs> no, I, I don't know. I, I like all kinds of foods. I actually don't like seafood very much. For me, I, I just like I just like good food. I like all kinds, but probably like uh, special treats. Always Italian. I always like Italian food. My food's very delicious. We'll store these for now. How much do I need for the furnace? 20 copper ore and 25 stone, so a lot more than I have right now. We tried Guy Fieri's food. It, Guy Fieri, that's the one that does this, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, that right there, that, 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 that's it. That's great. Mm. Is that that guy? And his hair is like... <laughs> Yeah, I remember watching his show in, like, the early 2000s at my parents' house when I was in high school. <laughs> yeah, he had the blonde hair that went spiky everywhere. Mayor of Flavortown. Yeah, I remember I used to watch him and then also, back in that time period, Bam Bam! Emerald Lagasse. Em Welcome to Emerald Live! Yeah, I, I I don't doubt he's completely very successful because people like people they can relate to on TV, and he's very relatable to a lot of Americans. Just a guy that just likes to get some good food. Boy, I see a slime. He forgot the sword. Oh, no. So I got to try to not fight anything. <laughs> it's always something that's mildly important. Okay, there's a bit. Oh, let me go grab all that coal right there. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, never mind. I can't grab that, actually. Ooh, what's this? This is all shiny. Jade. Level five. Perfect. Oh, 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 oh. Get out. Get out. Okay, let's go back and get our, our sword. Drop off these uh, minerals at the place, though, real fast. Ooh, there's a horse radish over there. Let me grab that, too. Yay, what a fun day. I love that. Yeah, the update's out. came out today. It's free. So just download it only on PC. So it might take a while to get on console, but it's on PC now. And so far, so far it's just like a, a nice little sprinkle on top of the old game. So as you're going through, you'll notice a little bit here, a little bit there. Yeah, we're on the new farm, the one that where you start with a coop. And it's got a really pretty layout. Does... Um, people that like to make pretty farms and then show them off are going to love the new farm. It's very pretty. The layout is nice. Okay. You, you haven't played Stardew since 1.0. Oh. 
you haven't done 1.5? Oh my. 1.5 drastically changes the game. If you haven't experienced 1.5, you're in for a treat. Don't spoil it. Just install it and play it. Because 1.5, the update, added so much stuff. It drastically changed the game in many ways. So just play, and then you'll discover some really cool things as you're playing. I don't want to spoil it for you. It's just a lot of cool features. New reward. Ooh. Cauliflower seeds. <gasps> That's amazing. <laughs> and it's a rainy day, so we can go plant those right away. I wish I had more time to play the game with the time sync. That's fair. This is a long game. Uh, I believe you can continue your old save, though. If you really just want to jump into the new stuff, you could. You might be a little lost, but you could if you want to save a bit of time. But I do recommend playing through the old game. It's just really good. It's just good stuff. It's such a nice rainy day. So relaxing. I love that there's no music on rainy days. Just... Get to relax and chill. Oh, dang it, I'm on Switch. Oh, I'm sorry. Hopefully it gets on Switch soon. <laughs> eight-player co-op? I don't even know how you do eight-player co-op. That's like too many cooks in the kitchen with as little as the farm is. <laughs> that would be madness. Yeah, it there's there's always that section of the game pre-sprinklers and post-sprinklers. Pre-sprinklers can get a little grindy, a little like doing the same thing again and again, very high maintenance on the crops, but then but eventually you get to post-sprinklers and that's when the good stuff happens. Once you get um once you get the uh the sprinklers all set up everywhere. That's when, like, you get to like just relax a little more. You get to go in the mine a little more. You get to go fishing a little more, so you don't have to do crops so much. You get to get to relax and have some good time. Did I tell the chickens I love them today? Yes. Bussin looks really happy today. Perfect. Yeah, when you finally get that automation, it's great. Rainy days are great for mining, yes. Yeah, so you don't have to, like, water anything. Sell, sell, sell. Put this over here. I don't need the fishing pole in this place for now. I'll put that away. Don't need the seed. We don't need a scythe. I'll keep my hoe just in case I, uh, just in case I need to, um, hoe the ground a little bit if I see worms. Yeah, this is a new farm. You start right away with a coop, which is great. The new, the new layout seems pretty nice. I like it. It's really hard to let the hoe go, you know? Gotta hold on to it. Okay, let's go into the mine again. Uh, we're going to play for a few days, but I we have a conundrum coming up because Dragon's Dogma 2 and um, Rise of the Ronin comes out in a few days. So it's going to be a double whammy. That thing refused to, to stop living. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, 
Come on. There you go. Cherry bomb. Okay, come on. Boom. Boom. Okay, some slime. Yeah, that's a good cozy game. Might put it on our cozy channel, but first we gotta finish Final Fantasy. All right, grab. Perfect. Ah, uh, we played Lightyear Frontier. Um, the the demo. It was pretty fun. We played a couple hours of demo. It's a decent little game. Quartz. I think that bug meat's useful. I have, can't remember. Perfect. Oh, I see the exit right over there. Perfect. I just run to the exit and get all the copper along the way. Already out of space. Oh no. Early game problems with with not having space. Okay, let's go down there. I'm gonna get the copper. Perfect. Yeah, uh, Rise of Ronin is going to be probably a long game. Dragon's Dogma 2 is going to be a longer game. This game, we know, is really long. Final Fantasy is long. So it's it's a lot of long games coming out all together. So I'm going to have to, like... So what we're going to do Thursday is we're going to play both Rise of Ronin and Dragon's Dogma and figure out which one we're enjoying the most. And then we'll finish that one. And then we'll go to the other one after. Unless it's bad. There's always a chance that, you know, one of them would be bad. Does this game have an end game? Yes. Thanks to 1.5 update, a massive end game now. Uh, very long grind. Very, very fun. Really expands on all systems. Highly recommend it. Sorry, I meant Friday. Yeah, we still have Like a Dragon in there somewhere as well. I still gotta finish that game. Oh man, so many. Alright, let's sell. I'll hold on to this stuff for now. Okay, put all that in there. For now. And let's go to bed. If I can just find a way to not have to sleep every day and just like be able to stream endlessly, then I could probably get all these games done. <laughs> but you know, I don't have I don't have the stamina for that anymore. Okay. <laughs> Angle the Fallen. <laughs> Jeez. That's like a crazy over... Like... That's too much. Crap the Furnace. Deeper the Mine and Soul 40. <laughs> Alright guys, I've got to get going for today. Uh, thank you guys very much for hanging out and seeing the new Stardew Valley update with me. We'll play some more of this tomorrow. Uh, you guys have been absolutely wonderful. Thank you for hanging out and having a great time with me today. You guys have been absolutely beautiful. Thank you for the follows, the subs, the resubs. Just the lovely conversations. And I will see you guys in a couple hours on our comfy stream with some more Final Fantasy. And we'll do some more um, Stardew Valley on this channel tomorrow morning. So thank you guys for stopping by. And you guys have been great. I'll see you guys later. Bye, everybody. See ya later. Here's a little something you may not know. All video games take place.